<clears throat> the Great Trials. Excerpt from an Overseer's Findings by High Overseer Tinan Wallace. Spending two years in the company of heretics, the insane and those rare black-hearted villains who were truly practitioners of magic, I can say with truth that I have seen such things as to break the minds of most. While the trials and burnings weigh heavily upon my heart, I must chronicle what has been a unique opportunity to witness the multifarious perversions that the outsider bestows upon those who seek his black counsel. Many of those we faced were accused of bewitching their neighbors or family, controlling them from afar or even walking around in their skins. And I have seen this with my own eyes, as one woman slid into the form of another, prowling unseen until a vigilant overseer struck down both the witch and her host. Others detailed herein were found to stand in two places seemingly at once, or to vanish from one place and appear in another. Our work was dire, we knew, for if the followers of the outsider can truly inhabit the skin of another, or move from place to place like the wind, then how can we hope to erect walls to keep him out? It was these trials that first led us to investigate barriers beyond the physical. On Branding Heretics The heretic brand is reserved for those overseers who have committed heinous, heinous acts against the order, but have not broken codes that would otherwise result in execution. No contact, aid, or shelter can be given to one bearing the brand that one person is forever more unwelcome to the Abbey and its affiliates. When used, the brand is applied to the forehead so all can see the sins of the recipient. The chemical compound acts immediately, scarring the heretic for the remainder of life. The interrogation room here at the office of the High Overseer stands ready for branding for branding ritual should the need arise. The recipient must be strapped into the interrogation chair and restrained as the brand is applied. The heretic brand itself is to be stored in the same room. What we have is a man, aged 30 perhaps, slender, unusual tattooing on the face and chest, probably superstitious heresy, wearing some sort of industrial mask when we brought him in, stolen out of one of the whaling factories from the look of it. You're one of Dowd's men, aren't you? Caught at last. Give us a name, at least. What's wrong with his eyes? Opium? Laudanum? Are you with us? What's he doing? Some kind of fit? He's gone. Here it is, a pin, hidden in one of his gloves. Subject has administered some kind of poison. The effects seem to have been lethal. out of Coldridge Prison. That's clear enough. Why Corvo, the one man feared throughout the Empire, is as skilled as they say. 
He got through there with half the watch looking for him. He had help, yes, but how far does it go? The trail goes to Martin, but Martin knows everyone, everywhere. to the flooded district shortly or did he the fourth stricture extra from a work detailing one of the seven strictures restrict the roving feet that love to trespass they pay no heed to the boundary stones of a neighbor's fields they wander into foreign lands only to return with their souls blackened by iniquity where have you strayed that destruction now comes behind you would you walk across burning coals or broken glass? Then why do you prowl into the homes of the honest, or into the dens of hidden things? For the result is the same. You will fall into the void. Instead, rest your feet on a firm foundation, so that when the winds of the, overse uh, the outsider shriek against you, you will stand firm and not be overthrown. The second stricture. Restrict the lying tongue that is like a spark in the heathen's mouth. It is such a little thing, yet from one spark an entire city may burn to the ground. Better to live a life of silence than unleash a stream of untruth. The echoes of lies come back as the voice of the outsider. Desposi Desposition Log 73826, The Case of Agatha Harcourt. Disposition from Mary Wallace. I smelled a peculiar stench coming from Agatha's window one night. As I looked in the window, I saw her burning over a fire, the bones of something small, along with clumps of hair. Disposition from Herbert Alcott. On several evenings, as I came home from work, I saw Agatha peering at me unnaturally from behind her curtains. On the fifth day, I felt a pain in my stomach upon approaching her home. Outcome. Agatha's home was searched. Several outlawed items were found, and Agatha was caught as she attempted to flee from the back door. Her interrogation yielded little of use. Home and property seized for the Abbey. Remains cremated. Cremated, even. Oh, I'm sorry, everyone. I'm really messing this up today. Where are you? 
the movements of Corvo Atano. Known movements returned after an official deployment of roughly two months. After departure from Gristol, mission included stops at other major isles at the behest of the Empress Jessamine Caldwin, arrived bearing ill news, immediately apprehended for her murder. Last confirmed sighting, entered sewers underneath Coldridge Prison after escaping execution under unusual circumstances. Testimony from, citizen, from citizenry, Trey Dover, confidence, moderate, unconfirmed. Statement, person matching subject's description seen conversing with unknown woman near front gates of the Academy of Natural Philosophy. Testimony from citizenry, Benjamin Harabi, confidence, low, unconfirmed. Person matching subject's description seen fraternizing with Oxfords just outside the city. Testimony from citizenry, Charlotte Cadenhead, Confidence, low, secondhand. Statement, overheard conversation implying one of the parties involved had knowledge of subject. Suspected alliances, none known. Recommendation, search of the estate district based on subject's prior position of authority and privilege. And unfortunately, everyone, I'm going to kill this guard who actually saw me. Disclosure Log, 965. Name, Dylan Jacobs. Admitted violations, theft of neighbor's food. Recourse, half wages to be given to neighbor for a month. Name, Millicent Ridgeway. Admitted violations, adultery. Recourse, one year in service to the order. Name, Robert Young. Admitted violations, spying on his neighbor as she bathed. Recourse, public humiliation in the stocks for two days. It has occurred to me these people are acting as a police force of their own, not like the City Watch. It must be another organization with a religious bent to them as well. Confiscation Log, number 2749. Accused, Archibald Pelling, recovered, Iphigy of the Lord Regent, sentence, sentenced to three years imprisonment at Coldridge. Accused, Beatrice Gold, recovered, collection of animal skulls carved with pictographic sigils, sentence, home confiscated. Accused, Charles Hanley, recovered, book of rituals, sentence, home and property seized, banished to the flooded district.
Bunch of children playing games, that's kind of it. Go! And your niece, Callista, isn't it? I'm very concerned about her. She'll be found. My men are searching district by district. The poor girl. Callista's a resourceful one. Probably found a safe place to hold up in all this chaos. If my associates hear any word, I'll come straight to you. Now for drinks. I hope you won't refuse. It'll make this business pass all the quicker. Locked? Been in here. Let me see. It seems I have the wrong one. Mm, not that one. Ah, here we are. Now if you'll join me. Men will come get you when we're finished. Keep each other entertained in the meantime. I don't understand how this got so unpleasant. Oh, I agree, I agree. A whore dies and suddenly this. Will you have wine? It's a Tivian Red. Thank you. What a... Who's been in here? I owe you an apology, Captain. This is hardly the hospitality I plan for you. Well, time to do this the hard way. What was that, Campbell? Never mind. It's a stroke of luck for you, Captain. I'm forced to break out the real vintage. Leave the men here. But we'll have to share with all of them. <laughs> Very well, Campbell. As long as we get this little dispute settled. Stop playing and come out at once.
are bad. Could the city get any worse? Indeed, I believe so. Sister, she's not a witch. I know her. Out of the way, huh? You expect Get guards to me. You appeared as if from nowhere. We would both be dead if not for you. We are forever in your debt. I cannot thank you enough. I must get my sister to safety, but first, I may know of a way to thank you. There's a safe in the bunkhouse. The combination is two, zero, three. Take what you want, and good luck. Abductee Manifest The fallen children have been brought to Godfrey's farm, awaiting passage to Whitecliff on the 13th day, month of seeds. Jude Thornton, Ada Hargreave, Nicholas Rains, Patrick Fagan, Roland Williams, Zachary Clendon, Thomas Jordan, Kent Hodginson. Ration allotment, 12 crusts of bread, 1 wheel of blood ox cheese, 5 tins of brined hagfish.
once they are brought here, they never leave. The overseers always find the guild they seek. More tools. Trevor, we're going to need another shipment of tools to destroy these accursed bone charms. Though we managed to break down over a dozen last month, there are more coming in from all over Gristol. And these things are remarkably resilient. Edgar. Unnerving target. Enemies have a slight chance to miss with guns. You know what? I'm going to take this bone charm instead of taking Twist of Fate. And we have three runes. I did not even realize that. That's enough to upgrade agility to rank two. At level one, as you can see, your jump height was increased by giving us a double jump. And we take reduced falling damage. At level 2, our overall movement speed is increased. It's slight, but we'll appreciate it, I think. The Metaphysica Mysterium, extra from a longer band work on supernatural ritual. It is said that we should not sully our hands when combating the forces of the void. My studies have been deemed heretical by my brothers, but the rewards have been invaluable. 
I have harnessed the same energies employed by the Outsider and his accursed followers while avoiding their corruption. I will prescribe the twofold method in this text. Indirection, as the wholesome powers of the unwholesome powers of the Outsider use living flesh as a conduit, we can avoid being tainted by the th using the flesh of others instead. Containment. By using channels and barriers, we can focus these void energies in a raw state, shielding them from the perverse perspectives of the outsider. Replacement valve. Humphrey, would you see to it that this valve gets installed in that little supply depot by the loading docks? The men have been grumbling about this thing for what must be months now, as if there was anything of value on the other side of that door it's supposed to open. Keep quelling problems like this for me, and you just might make apprentice. Signed, High Artificer, Bartholomew. Exploding Hounds, Bartholomew. I've seen the harness you've been devising in that workshop of yours. If you plan to strap explosives to my precious hounds and make living bombs out of them, you can count me out of your plan. I'm the master of hounds here. Without my training, they'll never do you as requ they'll never do as you request. Signed, Houndmaster Wharton. We cannot doubt the effectiveness of Holger's device or the mathematical beauty of the music itself. We've seen it in action against the forbidden practices too many times to deny it. But the question no one wishes to ask is, is the incantation itself black magic? The boxes are priceless, but what's inside? Concerning the crossbows, Campbell, we initially thought it a great find when we came across some of those crossbows that the assassins had been using to harry our patrols. The models we found, however, have proven lacking. Dowd's men have greater accuracy and range, and I swear theirs reload faster. I'm recommending that we stick with pistols and sabers and count this as a lesson in where our strengths lie. Sincerely, High Artificer Bartholomew.
hiding place, day 15, month of timber. I managed to steal away one of the charms they were smashing in warehouse A. Smashing them! Such beautiful and powerful things, and my brothers have no idea. They'll never find me back here, though. Nobody ever comes back here. I can break up the door, and they'll never find me. It's all mine. Healthy Appetite 1. Food heals you slightly more. I th think I'll stick with what I currently have in equipping that one. Samuel, I'm here. We'll stop here, everyone, and I'll see you on our trip back to the hub. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.